All right, here is a note set on how to read a solubility or solution graph. So the first thing that you always wanna do when you're reading a graph is identify the X and Y axis. And so here we've got just the measure of solubility in grams per 100 centimeters cubed. Centimeters cubed also equals one gram. So centimeters cubed, it also equals one milliliter. So it's basically saying and 100 grams or 100 centimeters cubed or 100 milliliters of water. Um, so this is our solubility in water. And then here down here is our temperature in degrees Celsius. So if we look at number one, it says how many grams of sodium nitrate? So as I'm doing this, right, I would wanna make sure that I'm doing my critical read. Sodium nitrate can be dissolved in 100 grams. So there's our 100 grams, right? It's basically just telling us like, hey, we're using the correct graph at 10 degrees Celsius. So you wanna first do a couple of things. We wanna find sodium nitrate, which is right here. And then you wanna say, okay, at 10 degrees Celsius, I'm gonna go down here to my degrees Celsius and I'm gonna say, okay, this is 10 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to go up to where 10 degrees Celsius hits the sodium nitrate line. And then I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna say, that is about 80, grams because it's saying how many grams right so then you're able to identify your units so you would say 80 grams all right um, so then let's do one that's not sodium nitrate and here's all of our temperatures right so let's see how about potassium nitrate number five how many grams of potassium nitrate can be dissolved in 100 grams of water Oh, at 10 degrees Celsius, there we go. All right, so I'm gonna go 10 degrees Celsius and my potassium nitrate line is right here. And so here's 10 degrees Celsius, there's my potassium nitrate line. And then I will go over, I'm gonna ballpark that at about 25 grams. So number five, you can do your about sign and then 25 grams. Um, so hopefully you can see right here what's our temperature, right? Or what's our, our, our pattern here? When you raise the temperature of water, can you dissolve more or less solid? So what are we seeing here in terms of our slopes of our graphs, right? Even sodium chloride, a small slope as it is, we can see that as we increase our temperature, our, the ability to dissolve more things becomes greater. All right, let's do one more. Uh, let's look at number eight here, potassium chlorate. Um, and so that one is right here. How many grams of potassium chlorate can be dissolved in 100 grams of water at 30 degrees Celsius? Let's go up to 30 degrees Celsius. And we're gonna go up to our potassium chlorate line. And then we're gonna go over. And that one is maybe 15 grams. All right, there is your note set on how to read a solubility graph.